Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is a little video on how to find and how to bring clip art into Corel Draw. I used to go out about it a long way, a long way around to, to bring it in, and I'm going to explain that. And also how to find it better. It all depends on what you're looking for. I used to type in fish clip art, and I would get all this stuff. And I've already filtered it out by turning it all black and white. I mean, if you if you just type clip art, um, this is more or less what you get. And then you can go to the filters and change the color to black and white. And then you get that. But if you just want a fish silhouette, you can just type fish silhouette and you get these images that are silhouettes. And then also when you're looking, look around for the size of the file. The, the bigger the file, the better it's going to trace that I've found. Like that fish kind of looks like this fish, but this fish is only 626 by 626, where this one's 1,024 by 422. That's relatively the same, but there are some fishes up here that are a little bitty, and then there are some that are huge. But we're going to pick this fish right here because I picked it before. Now, the old way I used to do it, would, when it clears up, I would go to File, Save As, and Save It, and Name It, and and then had to go to Corel and import it. Well, all you have to do is take your right mouse button and copy it. Open Corel back up. Take your right mouse button and paste it. There's our brought in fish. So just by chance, I wanted to see what it looked like. So I traced it. And it traced pretty good. I, I would clean it up a little bit maybe around this. but And there's plenty of videos in some of my videos that even shows how to do that. So when you're searching, if you just want a silhouette of something, a person, a player, a football player, search for silhouette. And then all you have to do, once you pick that one out, just left click or right click on him and you can copy him and put him right into Corel and save you some step. And what I really like about it, I used to spend, you know, a couple of minutes, you know, naming it and then had to go to Corel and, and import it. And then if I didn't like it, I'd wasted my time. Cutting and pasting or copying and pasting is going to save you a lot of time. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.